Some people dream success while you're gonna wake up and work hard at it. Yeah, all right, all right, all right. Hey, Calendar. We have Roy Calendar from Barbados. Mr. Universe, Roy Callender. And Roy was one of the uh, most successful bodybuilders in the 1970s, 1980s. Now, Roy Callender was a very popular bodybuilder in the 1970s, and he's pretty successful during his bodybuilding career. Uh, he won the Mr. Universe in 1977. He competed as a professional in the late 70s and early 80s, and uh, he also competed against some of the greats of our sport, like Arnold Schwarzenegger and Frank Zane and Mike Mentzer and Robbie Robinson. He had a lot of top five finishes at the Olympia, so this guy was actually a very good bodybuilder. He, he experienced very good success, so this guy's a very interesting dude, man. Pro bodybuilder, pro wrestler, IFBB Hall of Famer, Mr. Universe winner, top five finisher at the Olympia, very impressive guy. Calendar has a very impressive lat spread, probably one of, if not the best, lat spread for his time. Okay. Now keep it nice and smooth, okay? Up the good rhythm, and down the good rhythm. One of my favorite shots of Calendar here notices feathering in his legs. Another very desired trait for bodybuilders to have. Roy looked good from all angles. Pretty good aesthetics for a more muscular bodybuilder. Looking very artistic here. is one of the top three bodybuilders in the world. He has held the Mr. Canada title longer than anyone else. And each year, he is one of the select 10 invited to the Mr. Olympia contest. At five foot eight inches and 230 pounds of solid muscle, Roy Callender has truly one of the finest physiques in the entire world.